And now, let's cook with Rich and Jax. <laughs> and welcome to the wizarding world of Let's Cook. I'm Rich. And I'm Jax. And what are we making today, Jackie? Butterbeer! In honor of Harry Potter's birthday, we are definitely making butterbeer. Harry Potter's birthday is the 31st of July. Now, if you've been to either of the Universal Studios theme parks and gotten butterbeer, then you have an idea of what it's supposed to taste like. If you have not, like us, then you have no idea. <laughs> Osseo glass. Ooh. Osseo butterscotch. Ooh. And Osseo cream soda. Ooh. So the first thing we're gonna do <clears throat> is, wow, that was tougher than I thought it would be, is take a big old spoonful of butterscotch dessert topping, ooh, whoa, 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 <laughs> and put it inside the glass. And now we're gonna crack open this cream soda, so much fizz, and now we're gonna gently stir until it's all dissolved. Abracadabra alakazam, ding! Butterbeer. Mmm. Tastes great. Definitely tastes like butterscotch soda. You know what this is missing? Ice cream. Ice cream? How could I forget? Ooh. Pikachu, Mr. Mime Charmander. Ding. Mm. Now that, that's a butterbeer. Those muggles don't know what they're missing with butterbeer. It's delicious. Those silly muggles. I definitely taste the cream soda and the butterscotch topping and together they make a really tasty uh, drink and then the ice cream of course just doubles the flavor and it's all good. It's all good, awesome. All right all you Hogwarts students out there, until the next Let's Cook, I'm Rich. And I'm Jack. And have a magical day. Ooh. Bye guys. Just do it.